scandal rocking the Vatican. Pope Benedict's butler is under arrest, accused of stealing and linking, leaking top secret papal documents. But the case may be more complicated than it seems. ABC's Jeffrey Kaufman joins us with the very latest from Rome. Jeffrey, good morning to you. And uh, rainy good morning to you, Elizabeth. Hollywood, it seems, doesn't do scandal as well as the Vatican. Who would have believed that one of the Pope's most trusted aides, the man who helps him dress and serves him his meals, is under arrest? But did the butler really do it? He is always at the Pope's side. Here is butler Paolo Gabriele pouring papal wine. And that's him in the front seat of the Pope mobile, literally at the Pope's right hand. But now the loyal butler under arrest, accused of betraying the man he serves by leaking embarrassing confidential Vatican documents to the Italian media. Do you think the butler did it? I think the butler is too a simple person to do something on his own. You think if it happened, there are others helping him? If it happens, there are others helping him and maybe leading him. The leaked documents have been making headlines here for months, exposing money laundering and kickbacks at the secret of Vatican Bank. The head of the bank, who said he was trying to clean it up, fired last week. Open the doors and tell the world the truth. It's a plot Dan Brown might have come up with for his Vatican thriller Angels and Demons. Conspiracy and intrigue are nothing new to the Vatican, but Benedict's seven-year papacy has been consumed by very public scandals. On Sunday, the Pope faced demonstrators accusing him of covering up evidence in the mysterious 1983 disappearance of the young daughter of a Vatican employee, thought to be buried in the tomb of a mafia don. <laughs> Meanwhile, the embattled Pope is said to be deeply saddened by the arrest of one of his closest aides. People cannot understand how a modest man who began as a cleaner in the Vatican would betray the Pope. And the notion that this betrayal could have come from somebody who was in the papal apartment and a member of the papal family, uh, obviously uh, cause, is going to cause a great crisis of conscience. This morning, the Italian papers are filled with intrigue as the investigation intensifies. And here's where it gets really interesting. The papers say that the butler is just a messenger, that there is a network of Vatican insiders behind the leaks, including a so far unnamed cardinal who is orchestrating it all. This is one to watch.